Nathan Zacharias, the son of the late apologist, has denounced for months the lack of physical evidence, of the serious accusations of the private investigation of Martin and Miller, towards his father. His mother had joined the complaint, who also alleged irregularities in the investigation. After six months of asking for the phones, in order to see the evidence that had not been shown when he requested them, Nathan wrote an article announcing that he already has in his possession the cell phone from which they got the alleged evidence of Ravi's bad behavior. In the article, he affirms that experts will look for this supposed evidence, and although it takes a while longer, until now they have not found anything of what the Martin and Miller report accuses. I can tell you that so far I have not seen any questionable slash concerning photos in both of the phones I have searched. I also have not found any questionable slash concerning correspondence or data. This includes the device they supposedly found the most information. But what is also of interest is what I did find. The report said Dad had a note in his phone for how to say a little bit further and tie. They, Miller and Martin, presented that information in a way that alleged that his interest in, and use of, the phrase were for illicit slash sexual reasons. Well here is where I found the phrase. The context is, not what they said, to put it mildly. Directions. That's why he had the phrase noted. Just a little bit further is in a list of terms to direct a cab driver. Left. Right. Straight. Bridge. And a little bit further. The context could not be clearer. What is also clear, is the dishonest intent of the people who wrote that report. There is no reasonable way you can see that list and think that phrase has an inappropriate connotation. Their misrepresentation of this detail is blatant. So if their case was so rock solid, why did they need to lie about the context of this note? And what other information and evidence did they lie about, misrepresent or manufacture? But most of all, I'm thankful for God. I'm thankful that he's, he's built his church, that he's sustained our church, a Fairview Baptist Church, through this time. I'm thankful that he's strengthened me, my wife, and our family. And that through this, people have come to know the saving love of the Lord Jesus Christ. Through this, people have been strengthened in this country and around the world. And so for these and many reasons, I'm thankful. Uh, of course, there's still a road ahead of us for justice, for truth, uh, for our province and such. So uh, I continue to... to now, I just continue to have a, have a joy now that I can be out and pastor uh, my church and be with my family and see what the future has in store. Thank you. Thank you for choosing us to inform you. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell with the option all so that you receive notifications of new videos and do not miss any news of Christianity. I say goodbye until the next video. Blessings.